If they have any problems is making gold, that'd be really nice. Because I get quite a lot of money from that. No, nope, guess not. Alright, well let's just do a bunch of peace deal treaties. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What the hell am I thinking? They're the they're the leader of their alliance. I gotta wait until Aragon gets done. That way I can get the max prestige from this shit. Wow, it's amazing. My prestige is just going up like crazy now. Oh, I think I know why I'm not losing quite as much m money as I did before. It's because my men... The armies weren't full, that's why. Okay, never mind. Never mind, never mind. Come on, guys, you gonna finish up with that fucking siege already? Just a bigger army. Raise taxes is even higher. Hmm. I'd say raise taxes. It's probably more useful. It's not very much manpower anyway. I just hope to Christ that this war can finish up quickly. I really hate building out my war exhaustion. Oh, it's it's not even increasing at all. Never mind. Come on, finish that damn siege already. I mean, they don't have any other territory, right? Just Aragon? Yeah, I guess so. Okay. God damn, look at that. Portugal took over Kent. Fuck. England may cease to exist pretty soon. That sucks. Oh no, now the shit king is is the loyal, is the ruler. No. <laughs> I, I love what it says when you get a shitty king. It's just so it's just so funny. Like <laughs> We have been cursed. God have mercy on us all. <laughs> That's all it says. Literally, the description of the king is just we have been cursed. God have mercy on us all. That is so hilarious. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, I can just, I can just, oh Jesus, that is so cruel. Get rid of all those cores, you gotta be kidding me. Oh god, you know, <laughs> I mean, even though Castile is the, are the rulers of, uh, of Spain, I really wanted to see Aragon have some sort of threat to them, but my god, that would just be so cruel, you know. I get so much prestige from it. Oh, that'd be so nice. Three prestige? Well, hey, what the fuck? I'm getting a million prestige from that. Hmm, huh. that's weird. Okay, well, whatever. Yeah, it only went up by three. Well, what the fuck? I forced him to do that. It said goes up by one. Oh, that's weird. Alright, well, let's just demand stuff from Switzerland. Yeah, it's only increasing the prestige by one. This is so weird. <laughs> That's fucking stupid. Yeah, it goes up by five. <laughs> Can you believe that shit? It's ridiculous. Look at that. It only goes up by one for every. God damn it! I swear to Christ. It's so stupid. <laughs> well, I think if I was gonna take, uh,. Eh. Yeah. Probably gain cores anyway. Eh, yeah, what the fuck. Can see defeat. Doesn't matter anyway. Wait, could I force them to move my vassals? Oh, they wouldn't accept it. Okay. Well, let's just let's just do can see defeat with them. Well that's really shitty. I had not noticed that. When you uh when you ask for peace with someone, if you uh demand them to revoke multiple cores <laughs> It only decreases the fucking prestige for one. It doesn't matter how many you d demand them. That's ridiculous. I mean, that's ridiculous, you know? I mean, it even says one for each one when it's next to it. That just makes no sense. Alright. Well, whatever. I guess I'll go with it, you know, considering that I've been going with everything else that's been going on. <laughs> Gee, look at my prestige. It's gone up like crazy. I finally have positive prestige and near perfect prestige. It's like 53 now. That's awesome. Oh, cool! France's near, near uh, invincible king is now dead. Now they have a regency council. Great. Just great. My investments out. Cool. Trade's going up. Yeah, I think I think after I get my government up to 11, I think I'll I'll invest in trade technology again, because 
trade's practically already at 11 anyway, so... Oh, another call to war. Liege. Shit, I'd lose 5 stability. Liege, Venice, Montenegro. How in the hell are they even going to war with Liege while they're all the way over there? Montenegro, Transylvania, Savoy. They're, they're not even bordering them. That's so weird. How the fuck can that kind of war even happen? They can't even get to them. I don't get it. Well, whatever. No way. Sorry, but that's a bad... W oh, man, did you see that? My prestige went down by 25 when I did... <laughs> oh, man. Y you know, this fucking game is so lame. I mean, look at that. The prestige goes down by 25 when I, you know, <laughs> refuse the... Most insane call of all. I mean, literally, you lose five stability from that fucking thing, okay? And that's not that's not it, you know. Not only that, but I have to go to war with Transylvania, which are the, I believe, they're the vassals of. Huh? I could have sworn they were the vassals of Austria. Well, either way, whether they are or not, I'd have to go to war with a uh, with uh, fucking Transylvania. Yeah, that's not it. Uh, I think Genoa and a bunch of other places too. Look at that! Scotland's taking over some places. They're taking over Siena. How interesting! I wonder why they took them over. Okay. Well, whatever. I guess they can do that at will, considering the fucking thing isn't part of the Holy Roman Empire. <laughs> Speaking of the Holy Roman Empire, look at that! Holy shit, I have a... Ah, oh, yes! I have a... <laughs> I have a majority in the Holy Roman Empire. Why on earth are you voting for Mantua? <laughs> yeah, I... Uh, I don't think they're going to vote for anyone else anytime soon. I definitely have a majority now. Pfft, Brabant. You're kidding me. Really? Fuck you. Fuck you for decreasing my stability. Bullshit. At least I'll increase it within the year. Wish my damn money would go up. This really sucks how low it, how low it is right now. So keep building churches. Real marriage with my son. Yawn. <laughs> I just love how England has lost almost all their territories, but they still have those territories in Napoli and Sicily. That's just hilarious. <laughs> kind of crazy, too. I mean, how the fuck could that possibly happen? Look at that! Look how goddamn many territories Mancha was taken. They've practically... Yeah, they've erased Milan off the map. <laughs> how funny. And yet, I thought Milan was just a huge goddamn threat a while ago. Now they're just... They're not even there. They're gone. Completely removed. I think Genoa is gone, too. Yeah. Yeah, fucking Pope took them over. They killed Genoa. I swear to God. Things have been happening. <laughs> Interesting things have actually been happening all this time. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, hmm.
What should I do? I mean, I've got my I got my infamy down to a reasonable level. My king sucks. Can't really go to war and take over anything. I don't really have any decent causes for lies. As Holy War causes Bola and the Shawnee, I don't think I'm gonna go to war with them. Create an army. So that's the only thing I have, really. You know something? This arm, this, this, this mission could go on forever. You know, I mean, unless I, unless I just have an enormous amount of gold pretty soon, I, I'm there's just no way I'm gonna get that many goddamn men. I'm gonna cancel the mission. Friendship with the Hasbergs. Well, okay. <laughs> I'll try. Take a long goddamn time, but it'll probably work, eventually. Well, that's a possible mission at this point. It's not impossible like that other one was. Alright, let's try to get a royal marriage with them. That'll help. Okay. At least their yearly change will go down a little bit. Ah, now that's a good thing. <laughs> ah, I've gained a core on Tyrol. Excellent. Now I have a reason to attack them. <sighs> man, I want to go to war with them so badly. Oh man, they're only allied with Aquilia and uh, the Teutonic Order, but they can't get to me. <sighs> feel it right now. This is exactly what I want to do. Oh my god, I have all the allies in the world and they'll all come to my aid. Oh man, I can feel it right now. Get to roll, get the gold, get everything. <laughs> get another territory, get everything. Oh man. <laughs> but I gotta wait. That core ain't going away for 50 years. I gotta wait until I've got every fucking card. Look, my trade's going up even though I'm not even funding it. <laughs> That's awesome. Yay, my navel's about to go up too! Yay! <laughs> Excellent. My land's going up too. Excellent. Let's see where I am in the technology. Shit, still orange. And still one lower in the important ones than, uh... Wait, I'm higher in government than Austria, but one lower in land. Christ. Same thing with Bohemia. That's funny. Man, Ulm is my goddamn allies. Why will they share my... F share their fucking, uh, secrets of how fa how they how they get technology so goddamn fast. And Aachen, too. I mean, come on. How can Aachen have so goddamn much technology already? Oh, they must trade a lot. They must just be really rich. Yeah, that must be it. Okay. They got, like, about a million different things in trade for their, uh, nas for their national ideas, so that's probably what it is. This is great, though. I mean, now that I've gotten that event, I now have a fucking core on Tyrol. So that means I can go to war with them pretty soon, and actually have a reason to go to war with them. And from what I can see, they don't have anyone to really, you know, help them that would really help them that much. I mean, clearly they'll try to help them, but they don't have that much of an army. <laughs> I don't know why Venice is stuck there. <laughs> Bask in the glory, improve our reputation. I'm gonna improve our reputation. We need to get our infamy down so low that I can take over Lienz as well as Tyrol. Once I become Holy Orn Emperor, of course. Oh my god, this is beautiful. This is so beautiful. Look at what's going on. Everyone is voting for me except for Bohemia and Magdeburg, who apparently have a grudge with me for some strange reason. <laughs> apparently they just hate my, hate my guts to the absolute zenith of, uh... Of everything, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. I've got a majority, and I think Ladislav the second is pretty goddamn old. So you're gonna you're gonna get booted out pretty fucking soon, Bohemia. You're not gonna have a huge army anymore. I am. 
is when you come, when you become Holy Roman Emperor, everything changes. I mean, everything. You suddenly have a huge army. You suddenly have a force limit that go modifier that goes all the way up into the fucking sky. I mean, it, everything just gets better when you have a when you're the Holy Roman Emperor. Another goddamn pre pretender. But goddamn, look at how weak he is. He only has 5,000 men. <laughs> Holy shit. Hey, that's the name of one of my generals. Son of a bitch. Fucking general's trying to take over me. Kill that motherfucker. That's right, you can't win in a stand-up fight. Not against a goddamn kingdom. It's not even half my it's not even half my fucking forces. If I really wanted to muster my forces, I would have already. But I didn't. Just because you had to show up, I had to do something about it. Okay, I'll get a uh, bunch of courthouses up. Well, maybe maybe just one worms. That's the only place where I actually have a revolt possible. Okay. Good. My land my land technology went up. I can build a march if I have enough gold. I need 500 gold. Increases manpower by 500 and local defensiveness by 200%. Wow! We should put that in Onsbach. They almost always have a mission where you build up forts in Onsbach for some reason. Not sure exactly why. I don't know why out of all all the places on spot would be enormously important to defend with, but whatever. Okay, my production's going up again. Excellent. Uh Marcus, I liked you so much, but you were a shitty general anyway, so I guess it was sorta of good that you died. Alright. Oh god. Meinhard, you're not very good. He's got one in fire and two in shock, and that's okay, but it's not great. Wolfgang's actually pretty goddamn good. He's got one in fire, three in shock, two in maneuver, but still, he's nothing like Carl was. Carl von pa Pappenheim, he had fucking four in fire. I mean, he was just a brilliant general. For my time, at least. <laughs> For this time, at least, you know. I mean, the best stats I believe you can have for a general is six... Six in uh, shock, maneuver, and fire, and I believe it's one or three in siege. I've only seen one in the early years, but I think that might actually increase as as the years go by. I don't think it has anything to do with technology because I've I've a uh... ah oh, Christ, my master recruiter died. Damn, I don't think I don't think I can hire any really good guys either. Maybe it isn't that much of a that big of a deal. Maybe I should hire someone else, someone different. Someone give me a little bit better of a boon. Well, I could get a land tech investment. That could be helpful. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, once I get national conscripts anyway, it probably would be helpful anyway. Alright, screw it. I'll get a reformer. Armory Farmer, level 3. Good. Pretty good. That'll definitely help. Good, my production went up. Along with everything else, too. <laughs> Production flawed, I just increased it. <laughs> How's that for idiots? Sure. Oh, look at that. Austria and France are fighting each other right now. God damn, Austria has a gigantic army. That's a lot of men. God damn. Damn, and I was thinking of fighting them. Shit. I would have been crushed. I mean, probably not with my vassals, and I have 24,000 men myself, so i probably do pretty fine. Pre be pretty fine. So he's got about... about 60,000 men. Probably wouldn't be fair odds. But when I'm Holy Roman Emperor, whew, man, will it change. 
shit. Now they're voting for Brabant. I don't I do not want them to be Holy Roman Emperor. That would be bad. Because if they were, then everything would just continue the same way it's always been going. Shit. Well, there's no way I'm gonna get Magdeburg to vote for me. That's impossible. Pretty close to Cologne. They m I might actually be able to get yeah, I'm gonna f I'm gonna I'm gonna send gifts to Cologne. And then hopefully, once I get my relations with them up, they'll stop voting for Braven and start voting for me. That way I have a guaranteed election. Because if Lanislav were to die right now, it would be contested, it'd be tied, so... It might... I think they... I think they pick it by lot when it's... when it's halfway, you know, so that... so that, you know, they don't... So they, they just randomly assign it to someone. That's the idea. I can do it now. Oh, they're already voting for me. Well, I'll, I'll solidify that. <laughs> By bribing them. Good. Now. Now I'm very close to being the Holy Roman Emperor. I just have to wait until he dies. Hope to Christ that no one stops voting for me. Try or might. They're pretty weak. Infamy. <laughs> so in so Bohemia's got a shitload of infamy, eh? And so do I. <laughs> they got thirteen. I hey, he's got a lower infamy Yeah. <laughs> he's got a lower infamy limit than me. I guess I'm grizzled. <laughs> I'm a veteran of infamy. <laughs> huh. Probably the Teutons are really helping him right now. Definitely shouldn't go to war with him right now. Well, at least the French are pre pressuring them. I might, they might 